सम फोर नंदिनी एंड तानिया आर पार्टनर्स ऑफ अ फर्म दे डिस्ट्रीब्यूट सिक्सटी परसेंट ऑफ प्रॉफिट इन देयर कैपिटल प्रपोर्शन लुक एट द कैपिटल प्रपोर्शन इन ट्रॉल बैलेंस नंदिनी होल्ड्स अ कैपिटल ऑफ टू लैख फोर्टी थाउजेंड एंड तानिया होल्ड्स अ कैपिटल ऑफ वन लैख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड सो कैपिटल प्रपोर्शन इज ट्वेंटी फोर इज टू सिक्सटीन इट इम्प्लाइज दैट थ्री इज टू टू सो सिक्सटी परसेंट ऑफ द प्रॉफिट इज डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड इन द रेशियो ऑफ थ्री इज टू टू एंड रिमेनिंग इज द प्रपोर्शन ऑफ वन इज टू टू फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग ट्रायल बैलेंस एज ऑन थर्टी फर्स्ट ऑफ बार टू थाउजेंड सिक्स एंड एडजस्टमेंट्स प्रिपेयर प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अप्रोप्रिएशन अकाउंट पार्टनर्स करंट अकाउंट एंड बैलेंस शीट ऑफ द फॉर्म नाउ यू आर गिवन ट्रायल बैलेंस वेर इन डिटेल्स आर कैपिटल एंड ड्रॉइंग्स ऑफ बोथ द पार्टनर्स करंट अकाउंट नंदिनी एंड तानिया नंदिनी होल्ड्स अ क्रेडिट बैलेंस तानिया होल्ड्स अ डेबिट बैलेंस नोट इज दैट प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट प्रॉफिट फॉर द ईयर इज गिवन टू यू थ्री लैख ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड क्लोजिंग स्टॉक वन लैख फोर्टी फोर थाउजेंड मशीन्स मोटर कार प्रीपेड इंश्योरेंस बिल्डिंग रिसीवेबल्स पेएबल्स कैश एंड बैंक बैलेंस Notice that cash balance holds a debit balance of nine thousand six hundred, bank overdraft forty thousand, goodwill eighty thousand, bills payable twenty eight thousand, mortgage loan four lakh is a liability, rent receivable and outstanding wages, rent receivable is three thousand two hundred, outstanding wages is five thousand six hundred, commission received in advance, liability one thousand six hundred. Patents hold debit balance twenty four thousand, bad debt is of sixteen thousand. Furniture forty eight thousand. Adjustments provide six percent interest on capital, ten percent on drawings. In this way, four adjustments are given. Let us start with the first one. Provide six percent interest on capital. Now, capital of Nandini is two lakh forty thousand. Six percent of two lakh forty thousand. Twenty-four six of one forty-four, so interest on capital for Nandini amounts to fourteen thousand four hundred. This amount is credited to the current capital account and debited to profit and loss appropriation account. Same way, if you calculate interest for Tanya, one lakh sixty thousand into six percent, sixteen six of ninety-six, so nine thousand six hundred is the interest to be given to Tanya. Entry for that is, or the effect in effect while preparing final account is. Profit and loss appropriation account debit, Tanya's current account credit. Interest on drawing is to be calculated at ten percent. Nandini drawings eighty thousand, eighty thousand into ten percent eight thousand. Interest on drawing debited to capital account of Nandini, current capital account of Nandini, and credited to profit and loss appropriation account. Same way, interest on drawing for Tanya twenty four thousand into ten percent two thousand four hundred. Next adjustment. Provide ten percent interest on the opening balance of current account. Nandini has a credit balance of sixteen thousand. Ten percent there on sixteen hundred. Credited to Nandini, Nandini's current capital account and debited to profit and loss appropriation account. Tanya holds a debit balance of twenty four thousand. Ten percent there of two thousand four hundred. Interest on current account. So two thousand four hundred is debited to Tanya's current capital account and credited to profit and loss appropriation account. Salary of rupees three thousand six hundred to be paid to Tanya every month. So three thousand six hundred is a monthly salary. So three thousand six hundred into twelve, I think that amounts to forty three thousand two hundred. That is salary to a partner. Profit and loss appropriation account debit. Partner's current capital account gets credited for that. Tanya is to be paid 10% commission after incorporation of above adjustments and deduction of such commission. So we have to find out after pre by uh, by preparing profit and loss appropriation account, we should find out the profit before commission and 10% commission is to be given on a profit after deducting such commission. That calculation we will take care of while solving the sum. Now let us start preparation of final accounts as we are question. So we prepare profit and loss appropriation account, partners current capital account and balance sheet. 
Now the first adjustment provides six percent interest on capital. Capital fixed capital is recorded straight when the balance sheet liability side. Interest at the rate of six percent is calculated thereon. Two lakh forty thousand into six percent fourteen thousand four hundred. One lakh sixty thousand into six percent nine thousand six hundred. Debited to profit and loss appropriation account, credited to current capital account of Nandini, nine thousand six hundred debited to profit and loss appropriation account, credited to Tanya's current account. Ten percent interest on drawings. Drawings are debited to current capital account, eighty thousand debited to Nandini's current capital account, and twenty four thousand debited to Tanya's current capital account. Now let's calculate interest at the rate of ten percent. 80,000 into 10% amounts to 8,000, and 24,000 into 10% that amounts to 2,400. Profit and loss appropriation account is credited, and current capital account of the partners are debited. Next, provide 10% interest on opening balance of current account. Let us write down the balance of current account. Nandini holds credit balance recorded on the credit side of current capital account of Nandini. Twenty-four thousand is the debit balance for Tanya recorded on the debit side of Tanya's current capital account. Interest at the rate of ten percent requires to be calculated. So sixteen thousand into ten percent amounts to sixteen hundred, and twenty-four thousand into ten percent amounts to two thousand four hundred. Sixteen hundred. Interest on credit balance debited to profit and loss appropriation account and credited to current capital account of Nandini. Two thousand four hundred interest on debit balance credited to profit and loss appropriation account and debited to Tanya's current capital account. Salary three thousand six hundred to be paid to Tanya every month. So three thousand six hundred into twelve is the annual salary. Forty-three thousand two hundred. This is also an appropriation of profit, profit and loss appropriation account debit. Tanya's current capital account credit forty-three thousand two hundred. Consider the other balances of tar balance which are not taken care of while giving accounting treatment to adjustments. Profit and loss account credit balance three lakh twenty thousand credited to profit and loss appropriation account. There is a net profit for the year. Closing stock appears on the balance sheet asset side. Machines balance sheet asset side. Motor car balance sheet asset side. Prepaid insurance given in trial balance only one effect balance sheet asset side. Building five lakh twenty thousand balance sheet asset side. Receivable means debtors one lakh sixty thousand. I write in the inner column because. I know that bad debt is ever given to me in the trial balance. Payables means creditors, balance sheet liability side. Cash balance nine thousand six hundred balance sheet asset side. While bank over the forty thousand will appear on the balance sheet liability side. Bank balance credit means bank over the after. Goodwill intangible assets balance sheet asset side. Bills payable twenty eight thousand liability balance sheet liability side. Mortgage loan four lakh balance sheet liability side. Rent receivable, three thousand two hundred balance sheet asset side. Outstanding wages balance sheet liability side. Commission received in advance liability balance sheet liability side. Patents twenty four thousand balance sheet asset side. Bad debt is deducted from debtors. Furniture forty eight thousand balance sheet asset side. Now after recording all those balances from trial balance, we should try to find out the divisible profit. Before commission, because we are required to give ten percent commission to Tanya on a profit arrived at after deducting such commission. So total of credit side of profit and loss appropriation account three lakh thirty two thousand eight hundred. From that total of items debited to profit and loss account gets deducted. So here look at profit and loss appropriation account total of credit three lakh thirty two thousand eight hundred minus. Total of debit, that is twenty four thousand plus one thousand six hundred plus forty three thousand two hundred, sixty eight thousand eight hundred. So we get profit before commission. 
Now 10% commission is to be given on a profit after commission. Suppose that profit after commission is 100, then commission at the rate of 10% amounts to 10 and 110 is a profit before commission. If 110 is a profit before commission, then 10 is the commission. How much for? 264,000. If you work out that amounts to 24,000. This 24,000 is debited to profit and loss appropriation account commission to Tanya, credited to Tanya's current account. Now we will get the divisible profit. That is 2,64,000 minus 24,000. That is 240,000. Now this profit is to be distributed how? 60% in the ratio of capital. That is 24 is to 16. And remaining 40% in the ratio of 1 is to 2. Let us prepare a working note for that. 2,40,000 is the profit to be distributed. 60% thereof is 1,44,000 and 40% thereof is 96,000. In the capital proportion as we know, 24 is to 16 and 96,000 in the ratio of 1 is to 2. If you scale down 24 is to 16, it amounts to 3 is to 2. So 1,44,000 into 3 by 5, 86,400 and share of Tanya, 1,44,000 into 2 by 5, 57,600. 96,000 into one third, 32,000 share of Nandini, 96,000 into two third share of Tanya, 64,000. Total share in profit received by Nandini is 86,400 plus 32,000. That amounts to 1,18,400. Profit and loss appropriation account debit, current capital account credit. Same way, if we work out, total share in profit received by Tanya is 57,600 plus 64,000 that amounts to 1,24,600 profit and loss appropriation account debit Tanya's current capital account credit. Now we should close current capital account. Credit balance thereof will appear on the liability side. If at all there be a debit balance in current account that appears on the balance sheet asset side. Here we notice that looking to the capital account, we find that there should be a credit balance. So, total of credit side for Nandini and Tanya, 1,50,400 and 1,98,400. Deduct there from total of debits of respective capital account, you will get the closing balance as you find on the screen. That is closing balance for Nandini is 62,400 and that for Tanya 1,44,600. Now, this current capital account balance, credit balance, so transfer to balance sheet liability side and find the total of liability side as well as asset side. It should agree that amounts to 13,39,200.